Let's start by taking a look at the front of the unit. Here you can see the Allen Bradley logo, and on the bottom you can see the 1400s logo. Let's go ahead and zoom in here and look at the indicators. Here you can see the power, run, fault, and force indicators. And in the middle, we have the LCD display, and on the top right of that display, we can see the mode indication. Over the left-hand side of the display, we have the labels for COM0, 1, 2, DCOM, BAT low, and U display. And right below them are their indicators, along with the LCD menu, which we'll cover in future videos. Here on the right, you can see the buttons used with the LCD, and let's go ahead and zoom in and give you a close-up view of the 1400 before and after all the covers are removed. Now if we look at the top of the unit, we can see it's vented to allow heat dissipation, as is the bottom, as is the left side as well. Now on the right side, we'll see the product label, which if we zoom in, you can see our catalog number is a 1766 dash L32 BWAA. You can also see the series and firmware, as well as information about the inputs, outputs, contacts, and line power details, along with certifications like UL and CE. And if we look at the back of the unit, we can see it has two clips for DIN rail mounting, as well as mounting holes. And that's it for this episode of the Automation Minute.